hello everybody welcome back to my channel the wink leaf i am going to make chickpea curry today now most of you must have seen chickpeas that are white but there are also dark uh, we call them black chickpeas so there's a mixture of both in this bowl and i'll show you how to make uh, chickpea curry so in order to make that we need um, a small onion which i've chopped up two tomatoes fresh tomatoes plum tomatoes i have um, dry spices here cinnamon sticks black peppercorn cloves cumin and cardamom pods i'm also going to use turmeric and chili powder so let's start cooking So I have um, onions and all the um, dry spices in this pot with uh, two tablespoons of olive oil and that needs to be sauteed and until the onions are soft. So I will start cooking. And show you the next step. So now the onions are soft and I can smell the cardamom. I get the aroma. That means it's ready for the next step. So I will to get a good thick gravy you do need onions and tomatoes otherwise you will not the gravy we will not get the gravy consistency that we need so that's very important to remember always use onions and tomatoes when you make curry to use um, tomatoes and um, onion so in this pan i have um, chickpeas with uh, water and i put about a teaspoon of salt so they are from the can they are canned chickpeas which you need to wash before you cook them so i have added salt because the salt needs to get inside the beans so i will let that boil and then um, show you the next step so the tomatoes are soft I'm going to put in a teaspoon of turmeric and quarter teaspoon of chili powder which is red chili powder and let that cook everything needs to cook and blend before you add the chickpeas so this is the crux of the or, or the trick um, which is very very important so i grated um, four cloves of garlic and um, half an inch of ginger i shredded it and i'm going to mix that in now so garlic, onion, ginger, tomatoes are the key to get good taste and uh, thick gravy. Garlic is antioxidant, ginger is very healthy, turmeric is very healthy, so you can't go wrong. And I'll let that cook for a few minutes. So. The chickpeas are nicely cooked, they are all soft. And now, the moment of truth. So I will add all that sumptuous mixture in with the chickpeas.
the aroma is intoxicating with all the spices and it's um my kitchen is so fragrant right now i wish you can smell it so let that cook for a few minutes and let it all marinate the chickpeas and a small I just reduce the heat and I'll cover it so all the steam doesn't escape and, and it all cooks within. I'll show you the end result. So I wanted you to enjoy this with the background of Chopin classical music. So the chickpeas are finally cooked and this is the consistency you want. You can see all the spices are floating. This is cardamom and um, you can eat it as it is. Or you can eat it with um, rice, you can eat it with um, flatbread or any choice of your kind. So, hope you make it, hope you will like it and please subscribe, share and like this channel and enjoy. See you next time. Bye-bye.